Hello and welcome to MIND. Today is meditation day. So we will be sitting still in a supported position on the back and I want you to stay truly focused and intentional as you lie there. Don't let yourself fall asleep. Let your inner chatter release and just quiet. It doesn't have to go away completely. Being still can be a challenge, especially in this busy world and the busy lives that we lead. So do your best here. That's all that you can ask of yourself. So we'll get started supine in a lying down position on the back body. I like to have my little knee cushion underneath my back for this. And if it supports your lower back, you can take two yoga blocks or even a rolled up towel underneath your knees. And you may find that when you lie down, this offers a more supportive position for your back body. So settle yourself in right here. You're welcome to have your palms face up next to your hips or your palms face down, maybe resting on top of your hips or even the top of your belly something that feels comfortable. Make your arrangements, your readjustments. And then once you find stillness, take a slow breath in. Slow open mouth. Two more slow inhale. Slow open mouth. One more inhale. Slow open mouth. You are more than welcome to close your eyes or keep your gaze soft towards the ceiling or the sky. Give yourself permission to fully release here, to just be and to just breathe. Stillness is just as important as movement. Stillness gives us this place to learn and to solidify everything that we did take away from movement. When we're quiet and slow, the creative mind does have a chance to be released. And when you find your deep inhales and deep exhales, you may notice a shift to a state of more relaxation into your parasympathetic state. So while your breath can be generous, don't make it forced. This will instead induce anxiety. Stay slow and intentional. Give your mind a chance to just stay as is. Feel the space between your brow relax, the corners of your mouth gentle. Allow your tongue to fall away from the roof of your mouth. Jaw may go slightly slack. The back of your shoulders melt into your mat behind you. Fingers are relaxed. If you notice your fingers are curled in a tight ball, actively extend them. And then from that point, relax. You are welcome to do that a few more times if it serves you in this moment. In Eastern medicine, it's said that 
the curled in fingers are a sign of stress and those with more open and relaxed fingers um, have more relaxation in their bodies and their minds. Don't expect things to come easily at first, especially if this is new or different. Give yourself the grace to allow time. And know that repet repetition patterns over and over are a great way to practice what you want your goal to be. If you notice external noises around you, it's okay, you can focus in on that noise. Instead of having an attachment to it and assigning it an emotion that you're feeling in the response to the noise, only acknowledge that it is there. Then draw your awareness back to your internal noise. Hear your breath sweep slowly in and out of your body. It is natural for the human mind to wander. It is not natural to have nothing going on inside. So if your mind does wander, it's fine, it's okay. Let it happen, but still practice that non-attachment. Don't assign any thought that comes through, a sensation, an emotion, a feeling, or an additional thought. Like a cloud, take a look at it, let it float by. Quiet can be unnerving sometimes. Gentle challenge in the space as we spend the next few rounds of breath in silence.
if you want to take a little more time here just to be and just to breathe, please pause the video and take some time. If you are ready to journey out of your point of stillness, deepen your breath. Open mouth, exhale. One more inhale. Open mouth. Gentle movement into your fingers and your toes, your ankles and wrists. If you have blocks or a towel underneath you, be mindful. As you start to draw your knees in towards your chest, let your palms rest on the tops of your thighs. However you would like, make your way into a comfortable seat, whether that's rolling off to left or right side and using your helpful hands to press you up, or whether it's just pressing straight up from your back. Thank you so much, Yogi, for choosing mindfulness today, for stepping into stillness, which can sometimes be very, very difficult. From my heart to yours, friend, thank you.